Hi everybody, it's time for our bedtime devotion. I usually do my devotions in the morning. I like to make a cup of coffee and sit in a comfy chair and read the Bible, but you can do devotions anytime you want. God doesn't care when, he just wants you to spend time with him. Some people do it in the morning, some people um, take their Bible and read it on their lunch break, and some people do it at dinner with their family, and some people do it before bed, and that's what we're gonna do tonight. All right, so um, tonight's devotion is called Tasty Thanks. And our verse that we're concentrating on is God said, show thanks to God, Psalms chapter 50, verse 14. Let's say that together. God said, show thanks to God, Psalm 50, 14. All right, here's the picture while I read the story. Max Popple had been playing all afternoon. He was hungry. I think I could eat a gazillion hamburgers now, or maybe a moose, or even a house, said Max, rubbing his empty tummy. Just then, Dad said, dinner! Max raced through the door, washed his hands, and plopped down at the table. Everything looked so good. Aunt Martha said, yummy. Polly said, mmm. Max Tummy said, growl. And Max shouted, let's eat. First, let's give thanks to God for our blessings, Daddy said. But Max said, ah, can't we pray after we eat today? A tummy that's full will have lots more to say. Blessings, sweet everything, Aunt Martha said. I'll go first. Thank you, God, for my family, for the people I see, and that I can be here with my family. Then Mommy prayed, Father, I thank you for staying so near and holding each one of us precious and dear. Me next, me next, Polly said as she spilled some milk. Mommy mopped up the milk with a napkin, and Polly quietly said, Thanks for napkins, God. I love you. Daddy said, Dear Lord, I thank you for Max and little Polly and for making them healthy, lively, and jolly. Then it was Max's turn. He hoped God would hear his words and not his growling tummy. Dear God, I love you so much because you treat us so good. And I especially give thanks to this wonderful food. Amen. As Max filled his plate and his tummy, he thought about how nice it was to thank God for his blessings. This is a delicious dinner, said Aunt Martha. Max's mouth was full, but he gave a happy nod. Everything does taste better when we give thanks to God. All right, I've got Willow here with me. She doesn't want to be on camera. She doesn't have to be, but we have some questions to ask, all right? Um, do you guys remember a little nightlight here? All right, he is asking, he's wondering, why is it good to thank God? Do you know, Willow, why it's good to thank God? Um, um, can you, what can you thank God for? Can you guys turn to your um, parents or grandparents or brother or sister and tell them something you're thankful for? Well, it's great to have special times to get together with family and thank God, but we don't have to wait for just meal times. We can thank God all day long. Giving thanks to God shows him how much we love and need him, and it helps us remember how good God is. Okay, Willow, we're going to pray. Her eyes are already closed. So you guys can close your eyes and fold your hands, and we'll pray. Dear God, please help me to remember to say my thanks to you every day. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, Willow, I need your help up here. You don't have to be on camera, but we're gonna look at the pictures. All right, so here's our sleepy time activity. Nightlight, he wants to play a find it game and see how many foods you can find in the picture story. So I'm gonna put it on here. Willow, can you help the kids name some foods that you see on this page? I see Pea. a tomato, peas, mm -hmm. a muffin, a muffin, um, a piece of chicken, chicken. Mm -hmm. All right, 
So then when you go to sleep, thank God for many things can I go and back people now? as you can think of. Can I go back? Yep. All right, so think of all the people you love that you think can thank God for and think of all the friends you have that you can thank God for. Well, I thank God for all of you. You're my friends. I miss you and I can't wait to see you. But um, know that I love you and God loves you more. Bye.